While states like Denver have smokingly embraced legal marijuana for recreational and medicinal purposes, Texas is still standing in that no smoking section. But a strange coalition of activists, from weed smokers to Republicans, have come together to try and legalize marijuana here. In Harris County, District Attorney Kim Ogg has taken some of the bite out of being caught with a small amount of marijuana. But what will it take for those who are obsessed with bathroom ordinances in Austin to give marijuana? Mary Jane. Just a little bit of attention. Here to talk about their push to legalize that good good is Latonya Whittington, Michael Anderson, rappers Hippie Black, and Stone Ape, all with the Houston chapter of the National Organization for the Reform of Marijuana Laws or Normal. We have seen a lot of progress, as we said in the report from the Harris County District Attorney's Office, but nothing at the state level. There, they seem to be obsessed with bathroom ordinances and social conservative issues. How do you make this? A part of their agenda in this next legislative session? Well, first of all, it's going to take the community to come out and vote. We need to vote a lot of these politicians out with the stinking thinking. Um, we had a lot of bills uh, that we tried to push that were dropped. So we need to get a lot of those politicians out of there because they have the old ways of thinking. Cannabis is a healing herb and it helps people and that's something that they need to understand. We as the people we need to stand up and make a move. Now you use it for medicinal purposes. Yes, Tell us I about do. that. I have trigeminal neuralgia which is a nerve damage on the right side of my face and I have to take a lot of medicines, at least 11, the doctor wants me to, but no, I don't. I cut them down and I use cannabis, yes I do, and I use oils as well, and I use CBDs to help me with my pain, and it helps me. Are you ever concerned about being arrested? Uh, yes, but thank God for Kim Ogg, yeah, and uh, with the laws that she passed for Harris County, which really makes me feel a little comfortable, but at a lot of times I'm not comfortable. I'm scared. I'm looking behind me thinking, am I going to get busted? But this is medicine that we need. It's natural, and it is a safe herb. It's not dangerous. Let's bring Michael into this. How do we keep politicians from thinking this is just about your personal use? I think it's uh, we start by supporting groups like Houston Normal. Um, you know, I'm, I'm from Young Americans for Liberty, but we're working together with this um, outreach concert. Uh, we're trying to bring in young people and also uh, people in the black community with hip hop and, uh, you know, influence them to take a position of freedom when it comes to criminal justice and then also this drug epidemic. Um, for instance, um, you see opioid epidemic, you see uh, the synthetic marijuana. I imagine if, uh, you know, if uh, cannabis was legal, you wouldn't have these type of problems or they'd be a lot less. How do we get young people involved in this campaign? Uh, I just and come up a little bit in the light for me. Uh -huh. You like me. What you need the light. <laughs> <laughs> so how do you get young people involved in this and come up and You mean the you mean the hip hop movement or Yeah, exactly. Movement? Exactly. I uh, mean, I, I feel like uh, you know, you just you just reach out to the young people, you know what I mean? And are they forthcoming? Do they see this is a campaign that they can join and be a part of? Yeah, I, I feel like uh, you know, everybody wants to be a part of the marijuana movement, so mm -hmm. they need a they need a uh, uh, basically a platform where they can express themselves. So. And what can you tell young people out there to get them involved in politicians to say this is something we need come a little closer? Man just do your research the internet is out there for everybody you know definitely you know take charge of your own life and uh, you yeah. know be involved. And in the last 30 seconds, tell us how people can get involved if they're interested. Well, what we would like for you to do is go on Houston Normal website. It's HoustonNormal.org. And you can also get on Facebook and join us. We have uh, different things going on which you can participate and also volunteer. And talk to your representative. Let them know. Absolutely. Thanks a lot. Let me check and see if you got a joint on you right now. <laughs> <laughs> you got a joint on you? Uh, don't look too <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for coming on the Factor. I'm Censored.